Taochu cuisine, also known as Chaozhou cuisine, Chaozhou cuisine or Kaoshan cuisine, originated from the Kaoshan region in the eastern part of China's Guangdong province, which includes the cities of Chaozhou, Shantou, and Zheyang. Taochu cuisine bears more similarities to that of Fujian cuisine, particularly southern Min cuisine, due to the similarity of Kaoshan's and Fujian's culture, language, and their geographic proximity to each other. However, Taochu cuisine is also influenced by Cantonese cuisine in its style and technique. Taochu cuisine is well known for its seafood and vegetarian dishes. Its use of flavoring is much less heavy-handed than most other Chinese cuisines and depends much on the freshness and quality of the ingredients for taste and flavor. As a delicate cuisine, oil is not often used in large quantities and there is a relatively heavy emphasis on poaching, steaming and braising, as well as the common Chinese method of stir-frying. Taochu cuisine is also known for serving kanji, in addition to steamed rice or noodles with meals. The Taochu mu is rather different from the Cantonese counterpart, being very watery with the rice sitting loosely at the bottom of the bowl, while the Cantonese dish is more a thin gruel. Authentic Taochu restaurants serve very strong oolong tea called tea when yin in very tiny cups before and after the meal. Presented as gongfu tea, the tea has a thickly bittersweet taste, colloquially known as gam gam. A condiment that is popular in Fujian and Taiwanese cuisine and commonly associated with cuisine of certain Taochu groups is shacha sauce. It is made from soybean oil, garlic, shallots, chilies, brill fish and dried shrimp. The paste has a savory and slightly spicy taste. As an ingredient, it has multiple uses, as a base for soups, as a rub for barbecued meats, as a seasoning for stir-fry dishes, or as a component for dipping sauces. In addition to soy sauce, the Taochu diaspora in Southeast Asia use fish sauce in their cooking. It is used as a flavoring agent in soups and sometimes as a dipping sauce, as in Vietnamese spring rolls. Taochu chefs often use a special stock called superior broth. This stock remains on the stove and is continuously replenished. Portrayed in popular media, some Hong Kong chefs allegedly use the same superior broth that is preserved for decades. This stock can as well be seen on Chaozhou TV's cooking programs. There is a notable feast in Taochu cuisine called Jiat Da. A myriad of dishes are often served, which include shark fin soup, bird's nest soup, lobster, steamed fish, roasted suckling pig and braised goose. Taochu chefs take pride in their skills of vegetable carving, and carved vegetables are used as garnishes on cold dishes and on the banquet table. Taochu cuisine is also known for a late-night meal known as Mei Xiao or DAA Long among the Cantonese. Taochu people enjoy eating out close to midnight in restaurants or at roadside food stalls. Some Dai Pai Dong-like eateries stay open till dawn. Unlike the typical menu selections of many other Chinese cuisines, Taochu restaurant menus often have a dessert section. Many people of Kaoshan origin, also known as Teochu or Taochu people, have settled in Hong Kong and places in Southeast Asia like Malaysia, Singapore, Cambodia, and Thailand. Influences they bring can be noted in Singaporean cuisine and that of other settlements. A large number of Taochu people have also settled in Taiwan, evident in Taiwanese cuisine. Other notable Taochu diaspora communities are in Vietnam, Cambodia, and France. A popular noodle soup in both Vietnam and Cambodia, known as Hu Tiu, originated from the Taochu. There is also a large diaspora of Taochu people in the United States, particularly in California. There is a Taochu Chinese Association in Paris called Lamical des Teochus and France. Thanks for watching.